So, Robbie's my cousin. He lives on my couch. He doesn't pay rent. He doesn't clean. He doesn't do anything. You know, I love him to death, and I'm helping him out and stuff. But seriously, this he's got to get his shit together. So, I just bought Robbie this four loco Falco. Oh yeah. I, fuck. I hope he cleans up his fucking living room. Yeah, dude. Last time, a couple days ago, when we went over to your house uh, after we left mine, it was like. I couldn't even believe it was your place, dude. We walked in and there was literally just shit everywhere. I, I know, right? And none of the mess is mine. It's all Robbie's. How long have you been Flash's roommate? About two months. Two months? And uh, you have a bed? I have a couch. Couches are good. Couches are good. Uh, so you just sleep on the couch? Yeah. Oh, you did? Oh, you, you, said guys, he, you said he was trying to clean it up. You guys are probably just being dramatic because I've never been to your place. Everyone does this. They're like, I'll, I'll ignore the mess. It's so <laughs> no, disgusting. No, just wait till no, you see, man. Point. Just There's wait. like one piece of dirty clothing on no, the No, it's not no, like this dude. has been a one-time situation it's, it's where like Robbie it's... just like makes one mess and that's it. Like he no. does this every day almost. Like if we if we walk in there and this place is clean, It'll I'll, be pay you I'll pay you $10. All right? Yeah, okay. Because it's not gonna be fun. I have a lot of lives on my hands right now, and we gotta get back. We gotta get this four loco to Robbie. Before Flash, if you die, out. if you die, then Robbie has the place to himself. So if I die, Robbie doesn't have any income or support. I'm mean, I I've become a parent to a 22 year old. <laughs> I can barely support myself, let alone another full grown man. And I <laughs> who doesn't who doesn't that. like to move, who doesn't have any motivation. No it's motivation just... at all. I mean, when he did have motivation, it was in selling drugs. That's terrible, man. Yeah. That's terrible. So. And I'm not talking small quantities of drugs. I'm talking mass amounts. Who am I looking at? Serious questions. Recording. You You're looking at him. You can look at me. I swear I don't, to God, he's on fucking shrooms. I don't know what he does. Like, I I left for school at 11 o'clock one day. Asked him to clean the dishes. I asked him to clean the dishes. He didn't start doing the dishes until 11 o'clock that night when I got home from class. 12 hours later. Yeah, 12 hours later. He goes, I, I walk in. I go, what'd you do all day, Robbie? He goes, oh, I, I slept all day. Robbie, Robbie. <sighs> yeah, I'm kind of like one of those mail order brides. Boy, I'm the husband. Dude, we are not joking about how messy this place is going to be. You're going to owe me 10 bucks, man. I'm telling you right now, dude. See, I almost tripped over here. Uh, holy shit. Wasn't, was, I was not lying to you. I, you owe me 10 bucks, motherfuckers. I, I'm gonna have to bucks. hit you back, because I don't, <laughs> I don't See, know. I don't even think Robbie's here. That GI Bill is full of shit. I don't even know if Robbie's here. Whoa, Robbie! What the fuck? <laughs> what the hell, man? What the hell do you do? Damn. Wake up, it's time to start the day. Robbie, it's 5 o'clock, get your ass up. I like to drink, but it's like my life. So you say drinking is your life? Robbie, will you move your feet, man? I just, I, I just want to sit there. Robbie, just scoot over so he has room on the couch. Uh, I'll make you a deal, Robbie. What if I go get you some water or something to drink? Will you scoot your feet over? It's a deal. Is there anything you want to do with your life? I mean, you're going to live on, on Flash's couch for the rest of your life? Hell no. That's bad for my back. Dude, do you have a piss jug around how do you, you somewhere? Fucking, how do you live like this? Dude. Uh, How do you live like that? Should, I'm more classy than a pistol. Shouldn't half of the things on this table be refrigerated from time to time? Robbie, you have eggs that have been sitting out for God knows how long. Hey, man. There is a half eaten watermelon there. Oh, Robbie. The <laughs> like, what are you doing? Way to fulfill a stereotype, buddy. Yeah, yeah. Right. seriously. <laughs> drinking, drinking all liquid, liquor, bitches. I'm not trying to get racist here, but watermelon. Jesus Christ. Robbie, what the hell? Robbie, Robbie, Robbie. Hell no. I don't have a plan for anything. Making that day by day. What, which, what job was it that he called? CBS. CBS. Oh yeah. Robbie, if you had a job, like, are you going back home? What are you, you Robbie. Know, are you staying here? What's the situation? I haven't figured out yet completely. Mm -hmm. West Coast homeboy. To do what? This or someone else's couch everywhere? My girlfriend's couch is more comfortable than yours, asshole. All right, listen, that is a damn comfy couch, all, and you know it. First of all, I don't know how you're seeing that much. The swings are in the fucking cushions. You know why? Because you wore all the damn cushions down, sitting on it all the damn day. All the damn day. <laughs> All the damn day. <laughs> yeah. What are you doing? Um, I'm moving out to Portland, Oregon. My ex girlfriend. Bad move. You think it's a bad move? Then why are you moving? Uh, it's not so much a bad move rather than a committed move. 
because once I'm out there with her, I know that I know exactly where it's going. She just want me to drink, smoke, anything. Do you do you feel bad about Aleva? What you're doing here with, with Flash's place? Don't feel bad. I'm very grateful that he helped me out though. Cause I was in a bad place before. I was. <laughs> Demons. <laughs> what was your bad place you were in? Uh, I was a drug dealer. <clears throat> Just a light drug dealer, or were you was, really a drug dealer? I mean, I was bringing home fifty-seven hundred dollars a night. I've known. Well, I've known his hustling since the day I was born. That's all I've known. Ever. I don't smoke and drink, obviously. I'm like the black Charlie Sheen. So, you know how when Robbie says that he was a hustler from the day he was born? Well, Robbie was never a hustler when we were young. Um, his parents are the most upstanding citizens I've ever met in my life. His mother, Jackie, is the treasurer at their church, and his father, Bob, is uh, the lead training officer for a sheriff's department. Are we post students? No. All right, your names? Hi, I'm uh, Michael Falco, an acquaintance of Robbie. I, uh, I'm Brandon Perkins, I just met Robbie. And it's just like, um, you know, Robbie's a cool guy. There's, there's no there's no looking past that, but the guy is probably the laziest person I've ever met in my life. Like, you see bums on the street, and it's just like, this guy takes the essence of a bum and times it by 10. I don't even know how he does it. I mean, I mean, what, I don't know. You just met him, what do you think? Well, my first impression of him was, well, black. Well, here, give him his four loco. Yeah, so, you, know, you know how he gets if he doesn't have his four locos? <laughs> <laughs> right, I think that's everybody's for like, wow, Flash and Robbie are cousins. He's like, drinking a Four Loco, he's wearing a purple <laughs> shirt that says, kick it. I think it'll be good for him. Do you think it'll be good for him? I think it'll work. I mean, are you happy with what's going to happen or planning being happen? I mean, I mean, him leaving my apartment? Yeah. Yeah, I am. I'm ready to have my own apartment again. That's clean all the time. For the most part. 